What's up? What's up? What's up? Hey everyone. Uh, got some exciting news. Got a date and time set for uh, this kennel I've been looking at. Take uh, Nelly up to. It's six R upland kennels. Uh, so tomorrow at three, three ten. I'm actually going to go live instead of trying just to upload it because it takes forever. And if you have any questions, you guys can, you know, jump on my live, ask, uh, or, do, you know, check the facility out. We'll, we'll basically, it'll be, you know, walking through the kennels, seeing some of his dogs work, uh, you know, we'll go over prices live because those prices don't change so uh you know hopefully we'll be able to see like i was saying hopefully we'll be able to see some of his dogs actually work he says he can he usually works five or six dogs at a time so that'll be pretty cool to see i mean to see six dogs backing each other is pretty amazing especially with my dog you know he was backing last year, this year he's not. So, I mean, I'm gonna have to do a bunch more welling work with him, uh, stuff like that. But back to 6R Kennel, uh, my, my cousin actually found it. And uh, yeah, what I liked about it was I was reading through the reviews and stuff and I'm gonna try to get some references from him tomorrow as well because I haven't done that yet uh, but you know I've read people's comments and seem pretty pleased so that was my biggest biggest thing and you know there's a couple other dogs I know that are going there that I hunt with so well possibly uh, you know one of the things I'll be looking for is you know where the dogs stay uh, Obviously, it's going to be inside because it's super cold out here. I mean, it was a negative 22 the other day at night. So, I think mean, last night wasn't that bad. I think it was got down to 10 degrees, but I'm assuming the dogs are inside. Uh, you know, and with being inside, the other thing to worry about is uh, noise. Uh, dogs get to barking pretty loud in there you probably won't be able to hear anything but the dogs so we'll see how that goes we'll actually probably look around and see where he does his training we'll go over whether he does uh what he uses for live birds you know a lot of people use checkers because they fly back uh pigeons uh quail uh most most trainers don't use pheasants because they're more expensive but we'll go over stuff like that. Uh, like I said, if you guys have any questions or want to check the facility out and check 6R Upland Kennels out, just join me tomorrow at 3, 310 and uh, on my live stream here. Thanks.